Kiori everybody and welcome back to Elden Ring. I'm Skating Hobo, you can call me Bailey. And today we're going to be continuing our journey across this bridge. If you remember from yesterday, we were making our way towards the Grand Lift of Rold, but we kind of ran low on time so this seemed like a pretty safe good spot to just uh, wrap up. We are running, oh not too low on flasks, so we should be okay to make it across here. Um, I think there's a few like knights and stuff like that, nothing too crazy. But we'll gear up and get into it. Hope everyone's doing real well today. Freaking 31 parts of Elden Ring, doing good. I reckon at this pace we'll be wrapping up maybe a little bit after the um, Shadow of the Earth Tree DLC comes out. So we'll be kind of on time for uploads and stuff to be roughly when everyone else is uploading. But not trying to be the biggest trend at the time, you know? I don't mind if it's in the spotlight or not, you know? We're just having a good time. On the topic of a good time, if you haven't already, please, go check out the Fallout 4 playthrough. If you've been watching 30 parts of this, surely some part of you isn't just into Elden Ring. Some part of you's got to enjoy the commentary, right? So, you know, head over there. We got almost four and a half days worth of content worth of watching. Whoa, oh, I got hit by a big bow. I was like, what knocked me? It's this guy. But yeah, there's heaps of content over there. Just wrapped up part 100 and uh, made our way into the Nuka World DLC. And I had kind of forgotten how that DLC played out, but man, it is cool. It's like you go into a big, um, oh, that little backswing. Um, it was like a. Oh my gosh, hold on. I can't think about Nuka World while I'm doing this. You know what, you want to see what it's like? Go check out the playthrough. Part 101 is where we start Nuka World. Ah, oh, bro, no way. Sheesh, what a guy, huh? <laughs> Get the great bow. Took out freaking almost all my potions. Anyway, let's get our head in the game. Elden Ring. So we are making a way across this so we can head towards the mountain tops of the giants, I believe it's called. You can see a glowing little orb there, so I'll approach that from the right, try to push it to the side. I don't remember if there's like something that spawns on this bridge. Oh, wait, this guy becomes huge, right? Yeah, I do remember that. Well, oh shit, and he's gonna run me over? Hey, buddy! <laughs> don't do that. You know what? Bloody slash. Frickin' piece of shit. Yeah, I don't remember if something spawns on this bridge, like the one that had the Godskin Noble. I think it might just be the knights, and then you're safe to run across. So you're probably safe to just run past them, to be honest. And that's just for a Sombre 6, so it's not like that orb's the most important at this point. We've found heaps of those. And we're probably pretty close to getting the um, bell bearing where we can just buy infinite of them. So that's cool. So we'll head over there. I know that white light in the back looked like an item, but it's actually just a bunch of... Uh, text. You can go that way to go to uh, one of the watchtowers, but there's no real need for us to go there yet at all, so we won't do that now. We'll go there later. And yeah, all around the room there's heaps of like messages. That room above where we took the elevator down. Heaps of messages. Um, but most of them are all just like pointless and don't actually say anything, so there's no real need to run around that room from memory. But here we are. The Forbidden Lands. As you can tell from the look of it, there is fog, mist, whatever you want to call that, everywhere. And our goal is to basically run along this path and get to this big lift. Now, we could do that right now, but if you remember, like I've been saying, we've kind of still got stuff back here that we need to do. So I don't want to go too far progressing this way before we do everything out this way. So I think, do we want to do some caves? We still have a few more to do, right? We have these three. And then we could head over to Mount Gilmere. So maybe we'll just do these caves today now that we've got this safe little grace. I guess we'll start with the um, side tunnel. Oh, sealed tunnel, sorry. Yeah, why not? Got to get them done eventually. And yeah, we could come back later because obviously they'll still be here. But I don't know. I feel like doing it now. Hmm. Multiple paths. Uh, where did we come from? One of them will be the way out. One of them will be the way forward. Did I choose correct today? No. <laughs> nice. Cool. No worries. We'll just uh, go this way. I guess this kind of told me with all the notes here as well. And you can hear the mining actually. Oh, I wonder what kind of level smithing stones we may be having here. Oh, uh, 
Hey, brother. Oh, Motoros. Oh, really? Okay, go on. Away with you. I need to charge it if I want to hit them, I guess. Let's try it on this guy. Oh, Motoros. Okay, it doesn't aim that low. Cool, yeah, no doubt. Let's um try just a regular lightning spear. That's pretty good. It's enough out of you. I think the ones that are mining will be able to use the flame on. Flame on. Um, oh, my treasure, it's already been looted. Right, did we come in here? Oh, I think we did run in here a little bit actually, right? Maybe? I think there was a tunnel that we kind of did run in. Hi. Oh, not quite. Okay, so it's not quite a kill. Ah, oh, these are fives anyway. Maybe we did come in and open that chest, or maybe that chest is already opened either way. Empty chest, not hype. Hey, buddy. Okay, well that killed him. Can I, like, aim in the middle and kill both of these guys with one? Amatoros. Nice. Get your shitty little wagon out my way, boy. Alright, well where do we continue through here? Precious item door ahead. Oh, hey. Real fake wall? Nice. <laughs> Bro's chanting. Or chanting. Guess we'll, um, send it down, but we will check that this is a path. Oh, shit. There's a big root in the way. Are we gonna be able to make that? That looks hella shifty. Nope. Are we dead? Yep. Fair enough. Fair enough. I guess you have to take it slightly down, then jump off. Eh, live and learn, you know? No worries. That's not too hard to get back to there, so we will do... Oh, but I'll have to pull the lever to get the... <laughs> Silly. Ah, no worries. We'll figure it out. Alright. Hey, buddy, I'm back. Sorry. I know. What a drag, right? I think so, too. Is that poop? He's throwing poop at me, sir? You do not do that. Hey, bud. I'm back. I know. Oh. <clears throat> Excuse me. I missed. Wow, it really has no downwards aim. Okay. This is a very in front shooting spell. Ooh, hey, don't you be a little pooflinger. Yeah, it's enough out of you too. Freaking bro's trying to poison me. Um, I don't think you guys actually matter, to be honest, with your cracked crystals. You can just keep them. It's fine. Alright, so, anyway. Oh, my runes are going to be down there, though, so I'm going to have to go down there. Wait, I have an idea. Go fast, go fast. Retrieve, and... Oh, who is he? What a gamer. Let's get that light on, so we can actually, um, see. Alright, here we go. Look out for the chain. Yeah. It's for a five, I know, but, you know the principle of the thing. I wanted to prove that we could. Safe. Let's not send it back up. Ah, yes. Real fake wall. <laughs> I didn't mean to backstep. I meant to roll, but what does this all say? Could this be a dog? Ah, nice. Another fake wall. Damn. Oh, damn. Where is this one again? Mana Erdry Church. Wait, no, this is from here, the sealed tunnel. Huh. I don't know if I remember this one that well. It's huge, though. Look at all that stuff. Is there a dog down there? Is that what that note said? Something about a dog? Huh. Hmm. Okay. We'll be a root runner and see where we... Do we want to go there first, or... There's militia down there. I can see him. I guess we'll go check this. Hee <laughs> hee. I hear you. Oh, he's throwing the stinky little things. This also looks like a real fake wall. Yep. Oh, hey. Why can I not hit him? <laughs> oh, wait. Is it not? Huh. Okay. Fool me. Oh, hey. <laughs> I like that they're coming to me. Makes it a bit easier. Any more? Oh, hey. Why did you not get the memo? I forgot to page little bro. Can we... Oh, was there a ladder down there? I didn't even know. I mean, that's good to know. We can drop down and loot if we need to and then get back this way. What did you say? I know he just like laughed, but it sounded like he kind of said something, right? Like he was like, shut up a da, or something. 
Do we want to go down there? It looks like a death trap, right? Like, look at all these blood stains. I can't, like, see. Oh, hey. It's one of you pieces of shit. Do you reckon I can... Hmm. Will... Do they bleed? I don't remember if they bleed. Because they're like machines, right? Three should tell me. Do you bleed, sir? I got the stagger on it, but it didn't bleed. I wonder if we need to go down there and fight that. Hmm. Uh, would lightning bolts be better, actually? Oh, yeah. 700 old damage? That's not bad. Hey. Fuck you, buddy. I will cheese you right here and now. Maybe, like, two or three more? Oh, I'm gonna need to drink. Need to get my FP up, man. That's what we're working on there, right? So no biggie. There's a goal of the work in progress. Boom! Eat a whole bag of dicks, my friend. All right, well, before we... Ah, oh, we probably needed it to smash that, though. We will reset this cave and get it to do that at one point. We will. I'm not going to leave that behind. We'll see what's this way, though. Is this the intended path, or is this just a bunch of little... Wait, what? Bruh. Try crouching. You kidding me? <laughs> no. It's not going to work. Do we want to go down there? I mean, I guess, but we can't go back. Oh, hey, big rock. I didn't mean to... I mean, I guess that worked. None of them hit me. Hey, can you two do the thing too? Yeah, thank you. Man, there's a lot of rocks down here. Okay. I mean, I don't mind that we don't go into that room that's back, actually, because I want to go back there to get that um, virgin maiden to open that uh, rock for me. So I guess that's okay. It's just a lot of um, exploding onyxes here. Does Onyx even learn explosion or self-destruct or anything like that? Or are these things kind of mix and matching Pokemon now? <laughs> Just talking shit again. I know that's not actually copying Pokemon, guys, by the way. In case anyone thinks I really do think Miyazaki's out here copying Pokemans, Pokemons, whatever you want to say. Obviously, you don't say Pokemon, so that's a cardinal sin. Is this a wall? Oh, nah, but it's a bomb. Oh, it was a wall. How'd that one hit me, but the five up there didn't? No, I'm calling bullshit. Little idiot. This looks like we're gonna drop into a fight instead of going through a boss door. Okay. Safety does safely does it. Make our way down and around. I think I need sevens anyway, so like there's probably not even sevens in that rock, but I really wanna check. Um I guess onto that. And there's our root. Man, we're gonna have to definitely go back through so we can get to that virgin. Oh hey! Uh, Virgin Maiden, or whatever they called, area. There was definitely a lot of loot down there. Okay. Where's the boss? Come on, somebody give me a boss fight. Ah, oh, it looks like this is a boss door. Um, any loot? More check loot? No? Okay. Well, looks like it leads out to something as well. Okay, let's go. Onyx Lord. He just looks like one of those, um... Oh, what are they called? But those that use gravity magic. Yeah, hit him with a thunderbolt. Mimic. Bro is on the floor. Oh, and then the Amaterasu. Bro, who is my Mimic today? He is on god mode. And he's done. Thanks, Onyx Lord. You were fun. Onyx Lord's Greatsword. Okay. So where does this lead before we head back to the start? Oh, of course, it's, um... What the heck? <laughs> I'm saying, of course, like, I know what this is. Is it a tower? I mean, obviously it's a tower, but I can't remember which one it is. Like, do we need to bring a great rune here? Is this the one for Morgoth's great rune? Did I do this unintentionally? I think it might be, actually. Because, like, it looks like the same kind of building structure as these ones, the Divine Towers. So this might be the Divine Tower of, um... What would it be? Altus? Yeah. West Altus. And the other bridge that I talked about going to... Oh. Huh. Okay. I guess I'll have to 
either try remember how to get in here or we'll learn that later <laughs> but hey you know what that means seal tunnel's done um do we want to do side team or hero's grave i guess we'll go side team seems good enough that one only took about like 10 15 ish so that's not too bad oh wait hold on team i, I did fully forget oh, i know i said i wouldn't but i did but i've just remembered virgin of doctor hold on go back there probably cheese him again with some more thunderbolts and then um yeah okay so i'll just have thunderbolts ready for all these guys because it does about the same as the yamatadas right yeah cool at least that way i can throw it down at this one guy this one guy he walked here he got a thunderbolt in his ear with a knick-knack paddywhack give a dog a bone this local militia's going home <laughs> shut up bow all right, so I'll just ride this one down now that I know I've already got the loot, All right? Be safe, not sorry. I guess I should get my little hip light on too. Always good to still look around though. You never know, I might have missed something. It doesn't hurt to look. I mean, at least it does hurt your eyes, because it can be a little bit erratic, the uh, movements. Alright, so it was down there. So I want to go down here, take out all these, um, giggle bots. How many more? Oh, hey, there was like four? I don't know if they all come over this way, though, or if they, some of them stay in that cave. I'm not losing stamina, so you know what? Hey, asshole. That's gonna hit the branch. I should have looked before I threw. This is just for safety, you know? I don't wanna lose 42k rooms to this guy. This makes this, uh, as safe as possible, you know? Osh would be proud. Health and safety regulations, love it. Oh, he's doing some little shuffles. Oh, wait, wait, I don't wanna kill him. I need him to do the thing. I almost forgot. Sheesh, that was close. That would have been embarrassing. All right, well, let's go down. Hey bud, can you, um, rune arc, nice. Yeah, I need you to come over here and break this. Don't break me though, okay? Oh no, don't, don't grab me either. Did he do the thing? I'm trapped in the wall, I can't. I hope he did the thing. He didn't. Damn. Oh wait, he did, cool. Smithing six, three of them, okay. Nice, I don't know if there's gonna be other things in here, but it would have sucked if he didn't do the thing. I think that's all he's going to be in here, right? And then there'll be the ladder to get back up. Because it'll be like, hey, this isn't actually the path you want. And a Sombre 5. Okay. Well, I guess I'm glad we did that. The rune arc's always nice. Time for corpse. Shut up, Al. Let me... Let me climb. <laughs> so many other options. Put a message at the bottom of the ladder. What an asshole. If that's you, fuck you, buddy. <laughs> no, not really. Do you reckon it's easy to run back up or run back out? Hmm. Ah, we'll just run out, right? Surely that's not too hard. And there's maybe more kills along the way. Oh, no. Holy crap. Um, can't believe I'm alive. You guys gonna come down here? Because... Okay, cool. Bro, <laughs> what is that? He's like, I'll circle around him, guys. You then you attack... Oh, everyone else is dead. Fuck. <laughs> well, climb again. The, uh, climb of shame. Yeah, I fell trying to heavy attack a vulgar militia. Point and laugh. Do -do -do -do. And I'm just going to put it out there again, like I said yesterday. I'm way happy with our drip change. I think, uh, um, dude, not again, dude. Okay, now this is just um, silly. Climb. Like I was saying, I'm really happy with the Crucible Knight armor. I think it looks good, especially with the horns. Um, what I'm not happy with is walking off the fucking branch twice, so you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna go back the normal way. I, I, yep. Mm-hmm. Just jump up some roots and stuff. Shouldn't be too hard. I don't think there was much. Right, we just run past the miners. And walk out the door. Can't believe it. Just fell off twice. What a guy. Like I said, freaking the bosses and the enemies aren't even my biggest threat. It's my own coordination. 
my ability to not fall off things <laughs> is very in question all the time. But we're good, we're out, we're free. I love that sprinting doesn't drain your stamina when you're not in combat. Such a nice addition that games add in like modern games, you know, just that quality of life things that more modern games have. All right, now we go to the side tomb. That only took like five minutes, but it would have probably only taken two of it and fall off twice, but whoops. How far are we from a level? Uh, 72, I don't think we're gonna have that in our pocket, no. That's no biggie though. What do we got today? Skellies, bandits, imps, hmm. What the fuck was that? A pot. Hey. That means there's probably a big one like in the corner somewhere waiting for me. He looks like he blows up. Oh bro, calm down. Yeah, the black ones blow up. So you gotta be careful when you kill them to back off. Alright. So pots are the enemies of this one? Oh no. Oh no, I think I remember this one, dude. And uh, it's not fun. It's like a weird puzzle one, if I remember right. There's definitely one that's like a weird as puzzle that. Oh shit, hang on. Um, that has like multiple aspects to it, and it's like two or three identical dungeons that you like walk between or something like that with like transporter chests. Ah, oh, dude, I think this is one. Yeah, like. Betrayal. Yeah, this is a transporter trap. Do we want to go this way or does this take us back to the start? I guess we'll start by going through. I don't think the enemies respawn, so. I think the safe bet is to just kill everything. And yeah, by going through, I mean like also going through the window. Ah, oh, man, the transporter trap one is so ass. Maybe we'll get it first try, you know? We won't take that yet. We'll try and figure out the lay of it. But I know that there's basically like two or three identical dungeons that you walk between. And it's just like figuring out. Oh, shit. Damn, bro. Came out swinging. Oh, and he's got a friend. Hang on, guys. Guys, hang on. Don't bleed me. Hey, what did I just say? Freaking imps. Oh, Freaking... Hey, don't hit the wall. Oh my gosh, how many are there? Three? Ay, ay, ay. Anyway. Gotta check these for invisible walls, you know? I don't think there's invisible walls in the transporter trap one, but... Fuck, it could be real mean like that. Alright, so... There's pots, and there's imps. And there's whatever's in here. Doesn't sound good. Ah, oh, it's an imp with lightning bolts, which will hurt if it touches the water. Oh! Got me. Not today, sir. Where's your friends? I know there's not just you. Yeah. Ah, fuck you. Come on, buddy. Ah, oh, bro, really? You're too... Get, get more towards the edge. Get, get more towards the edge. Fuck it. We ball. Is there gonna be more around me? Yep. Oh my gosh, what a wind-up. Bro was like, I'll swing eventually. Okay. Oh, well, little Tommy up there with his grenades can just chill out. Let's take this one. But yeah, I don't think we've gone past any loot chest. I think they're all transporter trap chests that warp you between the two or three more. Ah, oh, fuck. Sup, bud? Oh, God, there's two. Hey, bud. <laughs> okay, that was actually pretty good at staggered him again. Nice. Ooh. Raw meat dumplings. Yum, yum, yum. All right, so we will figure this out together, but this, this might take a while, guys. I'm going to be honest. I'm not I'm the smartest lad in that end of room. See, I don't know if that takes you back to exactly where you were or if, uh, if that's it. It might, it might not. This might just be it. What a freaking trap. Okay. We try again. Is this right back where we were? Or is there different enemies in here? See, like, okay, yeah, that guy's still on the corp floor there. So the corpses are kind of what I'm going to try to use to figure out where we are. If we've been somewhere, or looks like we've been somewhere before. 
but there's no corpses there, we'll know, okay, this is a different, like, variation of the one we're in. But none of those were very useful, it seems. So we shall... Was it this way? No, it was up and then back. Oh, yeah, obviously our goal is to get over there and pull the lever, but then once you get there, your goal is to figure out how to get back, which is just as fun as it sounds. Unless, of course, you just want to, like, seppuku and go to the grace, because then that works, because then the door's open. But we will try to not do that if we can avoid it. <laughs> All right, where are we now? And who's going to jump on me from which side? Oh, is this... This looks like the first area, because we've looted here. And there's the thing. Fuck. And yeah, the boss door and stuff. Oh, man. What the heck? Um, so where does this lead us if we go back in it? Or maybe I'm, you yeah, know, maybe I'm just straight up overthinking it. There's even more to this that I just don't notice, and then that's what's getting me. Try ahead, but likely backstepping. Wait, what? Secret wall or something? Nah, no. I, that, I don't think that's what that meant. Oh yeah, this is back where we just went through. Oh, man. So, was there something this way? Or nah, there wasn't, eh? Hmm. Well, let's we'll see if we can figure it out. <laughs> Is there anything around under here? There's that guy up there, but we can't really. Oh, what's this? Oh my gosh, there is invisible walls. Fucking rude. And there's blowing up pots. Hey guys. Jeez, that was close. That was. It was cool. You guys are strong and fun. Okay. And the next one. Oh, that's something in my eye. Oh, this is where that dude was, I think. Is it? Yeah, because that would be that room. And, nah, see, there's no corpse beside that chest. That's how you know you're in, like, a similar dungeon, but it's not actually the same. Hold on, I've got something in my eye. i got to just reach around my mic. Oh, that felt uncomfortable. Loose eyelash or something. Okay, so... Yeah, like, that room is not the room with the pot boys in it. And I'm gonna kick this guy off. Okay. We got a corpse down there as well. So yeah, you'd think this is where the lever is, but it's not. There's just a gargoyle sitting here. And it's kind of like, y'all get juked. I heard you. Your friend down there is... Fucked. But yeah, now I'm like, okay, which which chest do we want next? Like, do we want to go down there? And do we want to go into that version of this? Or do we just go... Hold on. Let me just drink another. Is this going to be a trap room too? With, like, bomb boys or something? Will this take me back up to that area, but in the other one? Right? Like the one that we were in first? Yeah, he's here. Oh, maybe I've cracked it. And he's the one that we damaged, so yo, this must be right. Oh, I might have cracked it. Oh, hey, bud. Yeah, fuck you. Who are you? Is there more up here? Oh, a ladder. Huh. Okay. I didn't think we'd need a ladder to get to the lever. I didn't think we went down that far. Ah, oh, shit. Much this not be right either. Ah, shit. It's not. Where's this lead? This is... Yeah, I was like, oh yeah, we're cooking. Nah, bro, we're not cooking right now. We are still walking around in the dark with our hands out like, um, mum? Hello? Anyone? Okay, so where are we now? So this looks like the first area, but it's not. So this must be... Either the second dungeon, because this is where the exit should be, right? But it's not. It's just loot. Oh, hey, bud. Sorry, I just didn't want you to do that to me, so I moved. You good? Okay. No stress, no worries. 
So yeah, if there's two versions of the dungeon, let's call this dungeon B, we're at the start area, but instead of a boss door, there's just that guy and the loot he was guarding. And now we need to figure out how to get to the lever area. Yeah, see, that's where we killed that guy. There should be a damaged one down there. Hmm, which one do we want to take? Like, where does this lead? I guess we'll find out. A pot boy. Are you gonna wake up? Oh, hey bud. Don't worry bud, I got you guys unlocked now. Oh, exploder. That was not cool. I might use one of these too. We are running real low on health potions, but hopefully there's not too many more enemies before we get to the boss door return area. Still no lover. Damn bro. I feel you. Find happiness in solitude, my friend. Alright, so yeah, this guy's yeah, almost dead, so he's the one from way, way back. Not way, way, but... Fuck you. How many are down here? Is there gonna be some down here? Yes. Two, maybe? Last time there was four, or three, was it? Okay, so this is still Dungeon B. Last time we took that lower side, and yeah, I pushed a corpse down here, yes, okay. So yeah, last time we took the lower one, so I guess we should take this one? And that might put us in that cage room, but maybe there's somewhere else to go in that cage room? We'll just have to see. We're working on this together. Still only been actually 10 minutes, so it's not too bad. Okay, there's a ladder in here, this might be, we might be cooking. Got some little exploding Andes. Sheesh, such a big explosion, but there's so many cracked pots, it's so good. If you, you know, need them for your builds or whatever, if you've got no mage stuff or no incant stuff, it's a pretty good way to get some elemental damage out there. And again, if you just make them and put them on your hotbar, your mimic will use them. So you can just like look up which ones are the best ones or whatever and make sure they're on your hotbar, so mimic's got that. But we're not going to worry about it, I want a mimic to use buffs and spells mostly. Like I like the fact that he understands the assignment of like, rot the enemy so we can do like, forever damage. It's pretty good. Alright, so, we're in, oh, there's a lever, we did it. We're cooking boys and girls. So I think we can pull this, is there like a trap up here, why is there so much blood up here? And then, we just need to figure out how to get back to the main door, right, which shouldn't be too hard. I think that was just walking right we don't need to take any no because we dropped from the top which one was the one we was it the under one? Oh shit was it this one because the one that is down takes us to the copy room the one that's back takes us to the jail so yeah it must be the one up here surely oh god that's what I mean though, like, yeah, you think you found it, like, you've got the lever, but then you have to figure out how to get back again. But I guess the good thing is there's probably no more enemies, so we can just run and trial and error. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, where are we now? Well, this is the first one, yeah, I think we did it. I think, I think we have no stress. We just run around, and back up here will be the boss door, and we can grab our grace to get our health and stuff. Yes, awesome. Okay, that wasn't too bad. I guarantee you my first time here took so much fucking longer because it took me so long to realise there was two identical dungeons. Or borderline identical. What was it for a level? 72. We might have that. Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to close that uh, menu. Oh, I have the menu closed. You have to, like, remember. Simplified view to make it not closed. Might not actually, we might be just under. I just thought it'd be nice to be able to go into the boss fight. Oh, maybe. Maybe not. I'll just use these as well just in case. Surely 729 is enough, right? Yeah, it was 728, 71. Good thing I did use them. Sheesh. Alright, get our FP update a little bit more. Nice. Oh. I could die peacefully now with 117 in my pocket. Ain't nothing matter. Alright, who do we have today? Wait, acquire material? What was that? Oh, root resin. Right, classic. Try fire. 
Seek lightning. Well, that's contradicting. Not contradicting, but it's uh, misleading. Which one do I actually want? Oh, I can get uh, Decay off without having to use a charge now. It's on. Who do we got today? Is it a bird tree? Oh, it's a duelist. But he's got like little dogs or something? Oh, he's got pots. Okay. Who are you to wave your finger so full of pot? Mimic. Ah, oh, damn it. I was going to say, Mimic, you guard me real quick. I'll take out the little guys. Oh, he's going to kill the Grave Warden Jewelers before we even take out the little guys. Good breath, Bailey. You got this, Mimic? You doing all good? Yeah, I'll help. Hang on, little fella. You may not. <laughs> Mimic with the rogue lightning bolt. Whoa, what's happening? <laughs> there was so much effects going on. I don't even know if we have spells that have all those effects. Okay, well. Woohoo! Ah, cool, the soul jars of fortune. I like that. Get some more resin and be on our way. Nice, that wasn't too bad actually with the um, whole traps and stuff. We managed to get through that pretty good. You can tick it off and go to this side. I mean, it was just there. I probably could have ran there, but we're here now. Okay, so that was the loot room. We don't need to go in there. Is this one? Ah, oh, this one is a chariot one. There's a trap. Is the chariot going to spawn? And then I have to run back? Yep. I somewhat know your game, fool. How far back do I have to run, though? Okay, cool. And I guess now we follow him. Probably into, like, a gap on the... Is that a gap? Oh, God, please tell me this is a gap. Oh, gosh, can we make this? Oh, and there's light. Please don't tell me there's, like, shadow things again. Is this a safe spot? There's two. Oh god, there's two here. Nice. There's something under as well. Do we want to go down or do we want to try go up? Let's try go up. That seems like the harder choice, so... Oh gosh, are we going to make this? He knocked us in, so I guess we technically made it. But can we go anywhere from here? Okay, wait for him to go down and try. I might actually just run over to this one first, so we're closer. Okay, ready? Steady. Oh, should I backstep? No, we're not doing that. Oh, I'll get running now. So I'm already, I'm already gone. You know, no build up. Where do we go? Where do we go? What do we do? Ah, uh, someone call my mum. <laughs> okay, okay. We cooking? Oh, nice, cool. Now there's two, but they go like left and right lane. Okay. Do we want to be greedy? I think so. Oh, but we can, like, wait under. Okay, yo, nice. Nice. I do not know if I remember this one there. Oh, hey, bro. <laughs> okay, I think I want it to roll up. And then I go for the loot. But I'm going to be greedy. Oh, it's a key. Nice. Okay, I think there was this thing on the right side as well. Yeah. Oh, this is, like, a whole other path. Okay. Oh, you little shit. Come here. Fuck out of here. No, I hate you. That is not good. Oh, no. Hey, bro. Can you not? Hey, you like my breath? Oh, there's two. I'll take that. Kill them both. Nice. That worked out real well. Uh, let's get our lamp on. Or lantern. Uh, what were you guarding? Glove what? Any more are gonna drop down and freak me out? Okay, I guess we'll go this path for a while. Looked like we could have kept going down though from where those um things were. This looks like such a trap. Oh hi. <laughs> what did I just say? We are not gonna try to fight like five of them. Yes, I could turn around and try to breath them down the stairs or something, but I think the path we're gonna take is just down. I hope they don't follow. Did bro just go up or down? Um, I don't even know what to look for. Hello? Oh, hey. 
Okay, I think I want him to... Yeah, I think I want him to go above. I don't think those things are following, so we're safe. Uh, zero path. Oh, shit. What do I... Wait, we'll try the other side. Oh, yeah, get. Hey, brother. Look out. Idiot. Oh, he's going to respawn. Hang on. Not on my watch. Alright, is there a path on that side next? Oh, wow. Okay, you turn here. True. Do you turn there too? Oh, my God. What kind of savage fuckery is that? Okay, I have an idea, but it might be a bit fucked up. Will you go further now that I've gone further? Yes. And then you'll go further. Yes. Run. Oh god, someone's shooting at me. Where do I go? Oh shit, are you kidding me? Okay. Oh, there's one there. Fucking yikes. Hey guys. Okay. Oh wow, you have a very small area. Have fun, bro. Who is he? Don't tell me I need a lever some. Oh, no. I thought this was going to be, like, not open and we're going to need to pull a lever from somewhere or something like that. Okay. Is this to the boss door? Did we make it? Dude. First try? And it ain't even Friday. What up, bitch? Oh, I see you have a friend behind you. Two friends, even. Very neat. Oh, guys, please don't kill me here. I don't... I don't want the smoke. Please don't do it. Hold on. E. I do not want to die here like that. Okay, fellas. I don't have Sacred Blade, but I have your number. You can't hit me. Fire again. Bitch, you're an idiot. Now die like one. Yeah, it's a good thing... Uh, video game AI isn't quite there in like intelligence, eh? Because that could be freaking terrifying in those moments. Oi, oi, oi. Alright, who we got today? Ah, oh, cool. Dual Crucible Knights. Are you fucking serious? True, guys. That's how we're playing this one. Okay. Oh, bro went for the bubbles without me. I got it. Hold on, I can get in there. I can get in there. I got it. Okay, can, can I, okay, there we go, Mimic, you got a tank for a bit, bud. Oh, shit, it's hard to see through that rock. Don't worry about it. Mimic, please don't die. It's my only hope. Oh my god, he's not going to make it if we don't get in these guys both rock real soon. I guess it doesn't matter, we don't get like the attack boost from it, it just could be nice. Oh, bro, no. This is not good. I think we have a stake so we can try again and again, we don't have to like go back to the grace. Oh, he's rot, yo. Okay, you're my goal. Is he rot? I think they're both rot, this is good. We have a chance. That's all my mana. This is gonna hurt. Yep, that's fine. I saw it coming. Do it, do it, do it. Ah, oh, no. Not like that. That's gonna hurt. Oh, bye bye. The rot, baby. Mimic, what are you doing? Don't turn your back to him. Oh, 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 oh. oh. That, I guess, is how you get the Crucible Axe Helm. Remember yesterday I was saying, how do we get that set? Oh, baby, baby, how was I supposed to know? Oh, my God, that feels good. That was fucking terrifying. Not going to lie, guys, I did not think we had that. But first try, first tee? I think if you aren't already, you better drop a sub on the channel, right? Like, come on. Come on. That was pretty good. It was pretty fucking good. Okay, so it's physically worse, but it has better versus pierce and fire. And does it look cooler? Oh, dude, it looks way cooler with like the the the, the, the wider shoulders. I'm about that. And then I oh, don't let me stand somewhere so we can stand flat because it's got like a different back too, eh? Okay, these are basically the same thing, right? 
they are the same thing. Okay, we can probably just sell them. And the Greaves are the same thing. We can sell them. So it's only the axe armor and the... Yeah, you got axe or tree helm, which we can't equip because of weight loads, but like, bruh. Bruh. That one's less cool in my opinion, but like, bruh. Alright, let's go back to my horns. Are you feeling horny, baby? Are you feeling randy? Sorry, you probably don't want to hear a freaking grown ass man saying it in your goddamn ears. <laughs> but hey, that's fucking sick. I'm happy that we got that. We can tick that one off. And next is War Deed Catacombs, but we ain't going there today. Maybe later. I think for now, we can either continue along this path and then get to the next place, or we can head over to Mount Gilmere and start doing stuff around here. I think we'll just get the um, map area over here, because we've got like 10-ish minutes, and I think running along here will probably take about 10 minutes, whereas Mount Gilmere is definitely going to take more than 10 minutes. That'll probably be next part. Part 32. Okay, just a 7 in my pocket. So yeah, this area is quite foggy. I don't know if there's like mad real loot out here, but when you see the map, you'll understand why I'm just going to run straight through almost all of it. Because it's pretty linear when you look at it and you think about it. Like, it seems very mean for them to put a bunch of, like, rare or cool... I mean, they might. There might be rare or cool loot around here. But we got this guy here. Nah, bro. Maybe later. He is a challenge. Oh, shit. See? There's a lot, little gaps and everything. Little militias and stuff. You could stop and fight if you want, but I just... I don't know if there's a need to, eh? Like, there's glowing orbs, but there's Scarlet Scarab, Vulgar don't touch me, Vulgar Militia, I suppose I touched him, right, it's only fair, Scarlet Scarab, just follow the, like, everyone's markers, or even, it's pretty clear where the path is, it's where the floor doesn't, like, require you to jump up and run around. Nice, free seed, Cerulean Scarab, or Spank, Scarlet one up on the tree, but yeah, pretty much just keep on rolling until... You kind of can't, right? Oh, and we got the fight against the Kindred Night Spirit or whatever the frick it is. It's like a big gargoyle thing. Yeah, Black Blade Kindred. There he is. What's up, asshole? Me and Mimic gonna take you down. We've already fought like a similar outside the um, oof, the clergyman sanctum. So this ain't gonna be a biggie. Touch me, bro. Yeah, Mimic knows the one. Oh, again with the spinny flicky woos. I don't care. I'm going at you. Is he raw? I think he's raw. Yeah, he's raw. Okay, let's get into this. What up, boy? Big slash. Right up your groin. Nope, and it, oh, with the chopper, someone call this guy Tony Tony, oh, not bad, we don't even have region going right now, we're just in it, raw, yeah, cool freaking raw bro, but it was a bit late, but yeah, that is the Black Blade Kindred, nothing too hard there, especially if you've done like we haven't done everything else along the way, that dude is just a nice little fight, with some 60,000 rooms, thank you baby. But here we are, the destination. Oh, I guess he tried to run away. You can, you know, you can run up here, grab the grace, and at least then if he kills you, you spawn right here. But, um, it's not real biggie. And yeah, the path looks like this, but there's really, um, not much out there from Emory, eh? You just kind of do run along it. We'll go, probably go mine 25, so we'll just keep putting it up. Because it doesn't hurt to have more spell cast ability, you know what I mean? Got a, um finger reader or whatever if you want you can put your fingers in her mouth and let her suck she can suck your little digits <laughs> it sounds so gross <laughs> the grand lift of road let's hoist our medallion and take it rise now this this lift is actually pretty cool there's um a secret that it can do if you bring a different medallion here now we have one half of that medallion and if you've been paying attention you'll know what i'm talking about if you haven't been, well, you'll just have to wait and see. That probably won't happen for a while, but eventually we will be coming back here to be taking the other path of the Grand Lift of Road.
It goes up and down, as most elevators do. I believe we start by going up. Yeah, up to the top of the mountains, down to the bottom of the mountains, I guess we'll just say. <laughs> Yeah, as soon as we get up here, we can grab our map. And I think there's another grace, like, not too far from here, so we might as well grab that too. But the area itself is pretty hostile. So, you know, be on your toes or whatever. But it's pretty... It's a very, uh, it's a very classic thing for RPGs, though, to put the snow level in the last, like, third or quarter of the game, you know? Be like, ooh, they're getting near the end? Better have a snow environment up on a mountain because snow is easy to make, hard to make see. You know, it's good for low visibility. And, um, other than that, I'm like, yep, snow game. Classic. <laughs> it's actually one thing I did like about Horizon, the fact that you start in the snow and by the end of it you're, like, out in the, like, deserts and in the sunny areas. That was pretty cool. Because, yeah, almost every freaking game near the end is a snow level. But, yeah, we'll grab this map. I'm pretty sure not far from it is a grace. All the animals up here are like spectral, so no thin beast bones or beast blood or beast livers for you. Oh yeah, and there's a guy here. Well, um, touch this and have a chat. Looks like someone that we know, but it is not. And there's a hint for you. Finally, we meet the tarnished. We can't see his face though, it's covered. Why the long face? I fear that you were previously acquainted with this person. Yeah, this was Yura, the bro. That is most unfortunate. For he is dead. Well, I know that. I've got his freaking sword. Look at it. He gave it to me. Did he? Shabriri. Yeah. I, I don't know if you're like a deity or a demigod or a what. But yeah. To sacrifice something precious. Yeah. The life of a fair maiden. That you would toss into the fiery forge. Mm -hmm. so that you may be lord. I mean, she wants it, bro. To ponder, your mm, so you say. Requires her sacrifice. Whether she wishes it or not. But how mm -hmm. lord crown so. I mean, I'd look the way I came into this world, baby. Maidenless. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to skip through this, but basically, he's like, listen to what I could tell you instead of doing that. Descend into the depths below the capital, seek audience with the three fingers, not the two fingers, and the flame of frenzy, and then you can do the kindling yourself to burn the tree and save the world, and then he screams about chaos may take the world. I think he'll say it again. Yep, he's done. Okay, so yeah, that's kind of your hint, like, hey, if you want to do the frenzied flame ending, Go under the capital and figure it the fuck out. <laughs> I think... Do I have to rest at the Grace again for... Melanie to appear, or is she meant to be somewhere else first and then she comes here? Can't quite remember. Let's check. <laughs> um, Broski's still here. Melina? Are you here? Or oh, Melania? Or whichever one it is? Millicent? Shit. I forget where she is now. Shabriri's here. Oh, well, we'll grab our map, which is just back here. I don't know how I missed it. Yeah, it's right there. That way we can kind of see the whole mountaintops properly expanded. Boom. Well, so that is the west one anyway. So yeah, this is where we came up the lift, and this is where we rode along to, a, and there was that um, Knight's Cavalry. We will fight him, so I will put a little marker here to say that he still needs to be vanquished but yeah as you can see there might be something out here maybe and there might be stuff out the sides but it doesn't from memory there's nothing really worth caring about out here and then yeah, we rode around into here and there's some ruins and a path and you've got to make your way across this like skinny path and stuff that'll all be coming up and there's a tibia marina or whatever they're called down here and there's our assassination contract and we get some very cool looking armor there um, where did we last see Millicent? Where was she? Box here. Blackguard. Millicent was like... She was out on that hill. By the windmill, right? Hmm. I might have to look it up where she goes next. Because, um... It's kind of important to get her over here. But I don't remember... 
What step to take? Oh, does she go back to the Scarlet area? Mm, I don't think so, but... Ah, we'll have to look it up, maybe. But it's no biggie. Tomorrow, we'll be heading to Mount Gilmere, though. I know we just made it to the mountaintops of the Giants. You might be thinking, yes, we're going to progress. We're going to get to, like, the last... I don't know, maybe, like, the, the, the third out of five quarters or fifths. <laughs> I guess there can't be five quarters. What the fuck? Um, but, yeah. No, we're going to do Mount Gilmere next. I will take us over here so we can wrap it on up. But hey, as always, thank you very much for joining me for this part and for this playthrough. I hope you've been enjoying yourself. I'm assuming if you've been watching for like 31 parts, you've got to be enjoying somewhat of it. And like I suggested, maybe check out some other stuff on the channel. There's a whole other Dark Souls remastered playthrough on the channel. It was the first one I did. Um, if you're just thinking something else to watch, maybe give my commentary a go on something else. But anyway, I will catch you guys tomorrow for more Elden Ring. Have a great day. Kakite.